Hello Cancer! Welcome to your Singles Love Reading. Cancer in this reading will be um, focusing on the person who's coming your way, who's coming towards you. It can be a completely new person um, or it can be someone for instance that you met in the past or that you know already but you haven't been emotionally or romantically involved with. This reading it's not about your ex, okay? All right, so let's check. Let's take a look, Cancer, with whom we are connecting here today for you. Cancer, this is a collective love message for your sign, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your situation, okay? Let's see. Show me more about this person that is coming towards Cancer. What they've been through, their situation. What happened in their life? Who is coming towards Cancer, please? Who is coming towards Cancer, please? Okay. All right. So, Cancer, we have we have no you. Mm, this person might be an Earth sign: Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Uh, this is someone who experienced. Uh, breakup they might be divorced I feel they rejected an individual because um, we haven't here something to do with a financial situation that uh, might create uh, difficulties here and I'm getting that this this person here that we are connecting for you this new person this this person who is coming your way cancer is is um, they were involved here with someone who might have unhealthy habits. Yeah, and I feel they created a very, very challenging situation when it comes to finances. Okay, this is someone who very likely might be divorced. Okay, let's see. And this person essentially said no. Said no, I don't want to deal with it. You know, you created the situation. I feel that's what they said to their ex-partner. Um, they might be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or they their ex-partner has those placements in their chart. But I feel that ultimately it just ended in uh, they ended in a breakup, or this person uh, divorce divorce. Uh, they they partnered that at this that it's it's they. They are showing up here as they ex. Okay, they rejected it. They rejected them. Okay, show me more about this person here. This is someone who is very shy. Someone who is very shy but open uh, for for romance this is someone who wants to date who wants to be happy who wants to create nice relationship show me more about this person that is coming towards towards cancer we have someone here who is very good looking maybe this person is into in, in, in entertainment uh, business as well someone artistic as well we have freedom yes this person is now free uh, they are ready here to, to kind of expand their horizons this is someone who wants to date um, they are very, very good looking. I feel this is someone who is very, very well connected as well. You might meet this person here, Cancer, um, at the birthday party or some sort of gathering here. And it will be quite surprising for some of you that this, this will be a lady uh, that might be a bit older than you. But I'm also seeing someone who is very well connected, okay, or someone who has this kind of feminine energy. 
but doesn't have to be a female, okay? Someone quite gentle. Yeah, it's like I'm getting this gift here. It's like they are. Um, so please take it how it resonates, of course. But yeah, I'm feeling that. Cancer, this is someone new, okay? This is someone who is coming your way. I feel you haven't met this person. And I feel that you are going to meet them at some sort of kind of birthday party, gathering, uh, anniversary. You might, you might meet them through um, your common friends. For some of you, it might be through this mature woman here. And I feel this person is quite shy, but um, this is someone who wants to, who wants to uh, create, this is two of cups energy as well. This is someone who wants to create a nice relationship. They want to date, we have this freedom. I feel for some time this is someone who was enjoying their freedom, meaning they might have had um, like a casual connections. They were dating people, but I'm seeing them now trying to settle down. Okay, this is someone who is coming your way. Let's see. Let's see, Cancer. Show me more about this person. We have the hanged man. So there might be Pisces. We have a page of wands. And we have a five of swords. Yes, this is someone who who felt that they've been played. Mm -hmm. Four of Cups. by their ex-partner this is someone they dealt here with someone who was playing mind games uh, who was quite there was there's something toxic about this five of swords and this four of cups uh, together you know I feel that this person played mind game they tried to convince them something they created some sort of false reality they were trying to convince that things are fine but this person here that we are connecting for you in this reading for for a long time felt really unhappy with the four of cups yes and I feel there was a divorce this is someone who might be divorced but the situation was handled with justice. Justice also uh, in the tarot readings represents um, legal system. So it might be, th it might be a situation that uh, officially and legally this person part their ways with their ex-partner or yes, with their ex-partner essentially because uh, they were stuck in a situation they were stuck in a situation that wasn't make them feel happy. This is also Libra energy, okay? At the bottom of the deck, we have a three of cups. So is this energy of, at the end, this person felt happy. It's like a, <clears throat> excuse me. They felt happy, this kind of freedom. And I feel that they kind of enjoyed a freedom with the three of cups. They might have uh, been spending time with their friends. Let's see, um, let's see, because I'm getting here that this is a fresh energy. This is a new person coming into your life, Cancer. Um, however, please take it how it resonates. Let's see this person's, um, this person's seven of wands. Yeah, they're protected. This person's intentions when they meet you. Can you please show me this person's intentions when they meet you? We have a page of cups. Could you please show me this person's intentions when they meet you? We have a four of pentacles here. We have a nine of wands. We have the two of pentacles. At the bottom of the deck, we have the sun. Okay. This person might be Leo. 
I'm seeing that this person uh, will want to date you with the Page of Cups, Four of Pentacles. They might have tendency to hold to hold back, but it's I don't see it that that it might be like a significant issue. I feel that at the very beginning, this is someone who uh, will prefer to listen what you are saying, and then, for instance, if you ask questions, they uh, they will of course reply but it's like they don't want to hear so much I feel at the first date this person when they meet you they will they will I feel they will instantly want to date you or to ask you out with this page of cups but during this kind of a um, this meeting here or this date with the four of pentacles and the nine of wands you can get an impression that this person is kind of holding back they have their guard up the thing is here that they are um, with the four of pentacles this is someone who um who is now i feel entering this kind of a period in their life when they are looking for stability for something stable they they don't want any more this casual connections um they want to create some sort of form of stability but in order to do it this is someone also who uh with the nine of wands that is this kind of energy of wounded warrior right this is someone who've been there seen it experienced they don't want to kind of be put once again in the same situation that's why they kind of have this they have they they might be the case that they have their guard up but um i'm seeing here it's just you know because of what they've been through here with this ex uh partner of theirs we have the two of pentacles um, and we have the sun so <laughs> we have a very positive resolution to the, to the whole situation at the end of the day this is someone who has pure intentions who who have pure intentions towards you because the sun is the most beautiful card the one of the most positive cards in a deck it always brings enlightenment it brings um, happiness joy and fulfillment this is someone who will want to date you it's not like that it will end on a one date because this four of pentacles here is like they are they want to with next to the page of cups it's like they want to continue dating you they i feel this is someone who really really like you and very soon actually this is someone who will kind of put their guard up and they will you know they will open up to you with the two of pentacles I'm seeing them being a little bit in a pickle actually because I feel that uh, within time this is someone who will want to kind of express their feelings but they don't kind of they are unsure how to go about it it might be a case that they will give you some sort of gift and we have these gifts I'm seeing something of, of uh, like a you know mm, like a token of affection let's say it that way but overall you can be reassured here that this is someone yes who've been through a lot um, but with the sun i'm getting very strongly that this person will have pure intentions and you will make them very very happy and they will want to continue dating you okay so let's see at this person's actions So we have a Knight of Wands, the Ten of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. We have a Four of Swords, the Queen of Wands. Okay. And we have Strength at the bottom of the deck. So I see here, Cancer, that within time, this is someone who will want to settle down with you. This Knight of Wands can represent that this, when this person went through this uh, emotional upheaval represented by this card, then they just kind of decided to take things easy, you know, to, to kind of see more people, to spend time with other people. Um, they wanted to kind of, they kind of liked being single, 
but and this is that kind of energy of knight of wands a playful energy you know uh, someone who might have been kind of not interested in a long-term relationships and liked b that that kind of casual dynamics when it comes to their love life but um this knight of wands here it's 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 heading towards ten of pentacles and this is uh stability this is a long term relationship based on stability and and happiness this is a card of relationships it feels like this person indeed their actions here yes you i feel that you will have uh so much fun with this person but ultimately uh, this individual will want to will will want to take this connection into the next level with the ten of pentacles therefore this is someone who uh, will want to be in a serious relationship with you we have a four of swords and we have a queen of wands i feel that, that you know when you meet this person cancer you just like you will it will just it will click because I feel that energetically you'll be quite uh, similar. I mean, it just will make sense. You will feel very kind of nice in their company as well. Um, I'm seeing that um, both of you might be quite, you know, have a very good sense of humor. And, um, and it's just, it will be so much fun to be around this person. You know, I feel that you, you will kind of, um, get this vibe from them that you can be yourself you know and this queen of wands this is someone who sees you as who sees you as someone who who is very very um attractive very beautiful that you have this x factor there is something about your smile uh, something about your uh sense of humor you know that kind of uh that it will it's just uh, it's it's a, I'm getting very strong kind of soulmate energy people just liking each other liking the company they feel very comfortable they can be themselves even if there is that kind of you know uh, they, they are not kind of a you know feel uncomfortable or something like this no I, I just feel this instant connection so much laughter and just happiness just having a great time but the thing is that this person here uh, I feel that at some point they will tell you that they healed from that situation and it took some time and they are no longer interested in the casual connections and they want to take this connection into the next level. So um, I feel that you can expect um, this person to kind of at some point uh, they will let you know that they, they, they would like to um, they would like to create uh, stability with you because it just makes sense because both of you just make sense we have strength as an overall energy so we have this leo energy as well this person might be leo but strength it's uh, it's a beautiful energy because it shows that um, you will create a very strong bond with this individual this is a beautiful reading it's it's just yeah I, I just feel that you you'll have you 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 will spend s there will be so many moments of happiness and joy and laughter and you know that kind of uh and it will be so effortless i feel this connection will make you feel very happy and this person will also feel so so happy in your company that within time they will really kind of make you make you know that they 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 see future with you, essentially with this Ten of Pentacles. That they want to settle down. And, and it feels like that they, they would love uh, you to be that person by their side. Cancer, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly, truly, truly appreciate you, Cancer. If you like this reading, and if you like this format, please give this um, th this video, you know, the thumbs up and 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 leave the comment in the section comments below, and let me know, okay? So, so we can make it as a regular thing for you if you like that kind of reading. 
Once again, Cancer, thank you so, so very much for being with me. I hope that this reading was of help and I wish you a wonderful day. Take care. Bye.